I'm Victoria Lucas, host of Hollywood at Home, with an insider's look at director Michael Crichton's 1979 caper comedy, The Great Train Robbery. Sean Connery stars as a charming, resourceful thief in Victorian England who's determined to do the impossible, steal a fortune in gold bars from two heavily guarded safes on a moving train. The thrilling climax filmed on top of the train would be done today with stunt doubles and computer-generated effects for everything but close-up shots. But in 1978, when the movie was filmed, Sean Connery was eager to do his own stunts, including the dangerous one on the speeding train. Of course, the stunt crew had covered the carriage roofs with a special gritty surface and Connery wore shoes with extra soft soles for grip. Still, Connery slipped and nearly fell off during one jump between carriages. The director later remembered, Sean's carrying a bundle of clothes, a story point, when he makes the jump. And when he stumbles and starts to fall, I'm thinking, geez, Sean, don't overdo making it look dangerous. Then he dropped the clothes, which he would never do, and I realized, he must have really fallen. But he was such an athlete that the only damage was a cut on his shin, and he climbed back up and nailed the shot on the second go. Join us each week right here for another behind the scenes story, and for the best back-to-back -back classic movies, watch Hollywood at Home with me, Victoria Lucas, Saturdays at eight, only on PBS Six.